Okay, welcome back. Uh, we're here with our case. It's periodontal case lower mandibular, where we took out a lower incisor, a central incisor, and we're actually going to re-implant it back in place via a material called ribbon. Now I have the tooth that we removed. We rounded the apical region. We went ahead and prepared the tooth, cleaned it thoroughly, and we added our bonding agent. Now I'm going to add the composite. And I'm going to make sure this is the right color. So let's do this first. All right, adding the material. And this is just to tack it in place. That's all we want to do is tack it into position. Now we may use an opaque type of bonding composite because we don't want light to travel too easily you know and get a gray area in between his teeth so we might go on the back of that with uh, like an OA2 right now it's an A2 when an OA2 might be what's in order we can always change that as well we come in from the the uh, Hollenbeck, please. You can always change it from the from the anterior. Try to get it right from the beginning. Wipe again. Alright. So I'm gonna have a look outside the microscope just to be sure. And I am going to use some of the OA2. So we'll take away some of the excess here. All right. OA2. A little more opaque. All right. I'm going to go in an SLO. It right. brings the value down a little bit, so we want to change that and bring the brightness up. So we're going to go with an SLO. So that's a super light opaque. So here we'll go on the back of the teeth with that and see if that adds a little less gray in between. So let me just power up on the magnification. So we are we're going in interprox, so we want to kind of give the illusion that we still have tooth structure to look at. That's a little too much. I'll we'll take a little of that off. I can leave that where it is. And this is the lingual of the tooth. So I'm just adding this to give an effect, an illusion, if you will. Kind of a chameleon effect. And that's a little better. All right. I like it. So, A2 in the front. And SLO in the back. Let me do one more thing. Let me try A1. <laughs> try it on one contact. Do you want to sit up a little bit? You okay? Yep, back's all right? Okay. I'm just playing with color right now. I want to get the right color. Okay. Peace. I think I like the A1 better. Pardon me? Better than A2? Yeah. Where's the A1? That one. Right here? Okay. Yeah, 
that's better. Okay, wipe. Excellent. All right. So we work that out. More material. I'm just kind of coating it with some unfilled resin called Visor Seal, and um, I think we're in good shape now. That's going to go ahead and tack this in. Now we have to prepare his teeth and get him in the right position. So I'm going to etch just two teeth, but before I do that, cover this with a black top. We'll cover our tooth up for now until we come back to that. So here we are, back in the mouth. Not yet. I'm right, gonna get this tooth then. Before we do that, we're gonna score the back of the teeth. Mirror. All right up. All right, I gotta bring it back down a little bit here. Okay. All right, you can go ahead and open for me. Great. Now we said we have probably need to suction that socket again. I got a little gel foam here. I may put some in there, see if it does stay quietly. If not, we won't need any gel foam. Not much bone holding that tooth in, so there's not much room to even put any type of uh, filler. So let's see if we can just make this smaller with scissors, please. Okay. Hold on to that. Suction the side again. And do small suction of the side. You feeling any of this at all? No. Let me have a spoon excavator. Okay, and just cure it out a little bit to make sure there's nothing in there. That's good. All right. I'll put that in place. Just like so. Okay. Good enough. All right, I'm just going to gently continue to we have a cotton roll. You okay? Great. I'm going to clean off the back of your teeth now. Just make sure. I know you just had your teeth clean, but I'm going to make sure they're super, super clean. So just do that gently. Air on the mirror. And relax everything. Great. Now let's take this out. I'll hold it. 
I'll hold it. Okay, we're good. You all right? I'm just going to put a little cotton in between just to kind of blockade it for now. Okay. This is just to tack it in. the bonding resin apply the bonding resin again good deal We'll like cure that. Okay, so anyway, what we gotta have we have to do at this point, we gotta get your bite perfect when we put this in. So I'm just tacking it in. So when I ask you to close, I want you to close on your back teeth, okay? okay. Not on your front teeth, but your back teeth. And I'll try to tack it in, you know, to where I, I like it, okay? Mm -hmm. And also just relax your tongue. We don't want your tongue involved. Have the light ready for me, please. Let's pick this thing up with an instrument. Hold on, it's sticking to the pad. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay, we just want to tack it in place. Yeah, okay. All right. More material, please. More bonding material. A1. A1. Okay. You okay, Ernie? Uh -huh. Okay, great. Just want to make sure we... Just tack it in. Okay, let me just pull back. And the light right here. Okay, Ernie, bite down on your back teeth all the way. Hold it right there. Open, please. Bite down again, Ernie. Open again. Okay, bite down again, Ernie. Open again. Bite down again. As you can see, the tooth is right in the socket, but it's not all the way down to the same position. So I had him open, close, open, close, and I'm bite. Th you're biting down, right? Yeah. Okay, and he does clear it nicely, like his, the rest of his teeth. And then we'll adjust his bite forward, backward. It looks like the CEJ is all aligned together as well. So that's good news. And we got it in a nice position. Open, please. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, there's some slight rotation of the other teeth, but nothing to embark on that one. So 
Um, we're going to put the rubber dam on now. Do you need another break at all? No. You're good? Okay. I'm just going to go offline here. I'm going to get the rubber dam in place. And then once we do that, we'll, we'll sit you up in a more upright position. All right? All right. We'll see you on the next clip.